Hi everybody, we're going to start today with uh, how to transfer your Illustrator file into your Flash document. A couple of things to note really quickly. Remember how in class I've spoken to you about the importance of naming your layers and having individual things on individual layers that you feel are going to move uh, potentially individual of each other. So if you want this green circle to move independent of this purple circle, it should be on its own layer. This process is actually very easy to get started. Uh, first thing you should do is just zoom out and quickly grab the main selection tool, which is V on your keyboard. Make sure everything's all unlocked on your layers and just draw a giant selection around everything in your image. And then you're just going to copy it you can either do Command C or Control C on your keyboard, or just go Edit Copy like I did. And then pop into Flash. Make sure you choose Action Script 2.0. Um, this relates to some stuff we might do later in terms of writing scripts to have certain things happen within the program. Also, in years past, we've had issues with students who have tried to use 3.0. They've had uh, weird things happen right near the end of everything. So please remember to choose Action Script 2.0. Okay, and the first thing you're going to do is you're going to open up this area here and you'll see your screen for Flash. And very easy uh, first thing to do is simply Command V or Paste and Center or Control V if you're using your PC. It's going to take a moment to import and it's going to give you an option here. Make sure you have it just go with whatever the options are here, especially something like maintaining layers is important. You're going to see in a sec. Hit OK. Everything pops in, and here's the reason why I had you keep all your layers named in your file. They all come in here for you. So when you decide to make yellow planet fly across the screen, you know that that's the yellow planet layer. One more thing to do very quickly is do a quick right click on your white area around the image that's just come in, and you're going to click on Document Properties, and quickly adjust it to the contents that you've just pasted in and right away your entire project will fit exactly like it did in your flash document. Okay, that's step one. On to the next tutorial.